figured out that I can't go live, so what I'm going to try to do is just make this video and hopefully I can share it, either upload it onto YouTube or what have you. So, I just wanted to do a quick vid on mulled wine. So, somebody had posted a picture uh, that they were, they used colors that were discontinued to create a look. And they were asking folks to try to recreate it. I was going to do that. But the most important thing that I needed to do was show some folks how to use colors that are slightly difficult. And um, one of those colors is mulled wine. And um, the issue with mulled wine, well, first of all, when you're using mulled wine or colors like mulled wine, like apple cider, I think is another color, you want to shake it up really good. Okay, the issue is the colors are really thick. It's kind of hard to tell. So what you want to do is you want to scrape it off. I hope you saw that. So scrape it off so you have a little bit on the wand. Oh wait, this is my tester. Okay, so I'm going to do something different. I'm going to tap it out. I'm trying to think. Oh gosh, I have a really thick one, but it's ugly. Fine. <sighs> no. Um, pause. So, resuming. Mulled wine. So, what you want to do with mulled wine is you want to make sure that you've got most of your lip scents off. And then, wide mouth. Okay. Let that dry. First layer for me dries quick. Ah. Layer number two. Okay. That actually looks really nice. Had to make sure it was all done. Now, I'm doing something different. But this is out a layer number three. I like using brushes, so you tap to get it out. Okay. I go to the brush.
Okay. See? It's splotchy. Or <clears throat> that was four layers. So I want to do something different. I am going to create another color. So now I'm going to take my personal Kiss Horror Paws. Okay. I like that look. Ooh. I kind of like that. And now, let that dry. Trying to tap down. I like that. It's getting a little um. I'm in love with the cocoa. This is a nice color. You know what? This looks like Lexi Harry. All dying and kiss her cause. Ain't Lexi Harry. I knew it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And now it's gonna make it. Uh, thank you. Okay, I did it. So, okay, wait a minute. Oh, I look kind of cutie. Okay, trying to color my gray hairs. Here's my hand. I don't know. My hand is in the room. It should be here. That's the eyelash color. 10 minutes. This sucks. Oh, I'm weird. But anyway. Nothing on the wand. Okay. So, I did that color. That's good. This is a really nice color. I like this blend. So, this is three very, very, very thin coats of mulled wine. And then one coat of Kiss for a Cause. And then one coat of cocoa. This is nice. This is really nice. And I've got my makeup from this morning at 7. I woke up late today. And so I have the um, liner eye sense, which is the liner. And then the shadow that I use today, which I've been using all the time because I really like it. It's my favorite is Mocha. Why is that not? Okay, whatever. It's Mocha Java Shimmer. 
I like it. Boom. Long video. Hope you guys have time to watch it. But with mold wine, you definitely want to do thin layers and even layers to get it to look right. So this is something I'm about to take a picture of it and post it side by side. It's really, really, really shiny. Well, I'm moisturized. I can wipe it off. I'm going to bed with this. I'm not taking it off. Buenos noches.